Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. When a customer overpays you or gives you a down payment or prepayment, you record the amount received in the Receive Payments window. Doing this creates a credit for the customer or customer job specified. Later on, after you have created an invoice for the specific customer or customer job, you can return to the Receive Payments window to apply the customer's existing credit. To apply an existing customer credit to an outstanding invoice in the Receive Payments window, select the name of the customer or customer job who has the outstanding invoices and the credit you want to apply. Select the invoice against which you wish to apply the credit from the listing shown. You should not attempt to place a check mark in front of the invoice, as that indicates the invoice is being paid. Instead, click anywhere else within the invoice line, other than the check mark column, to select the desired invoice against which you wish to apply the customer's credit. Then click the Discounts and Credits button in the main tab of the ribbon at the top of the window to open the Discount and Credits window. Select the Credits tab if necessary to view any available customer credits. To apply the entire credit shown, ensure there is a check mark next to the credit within the Available Credits section in the far left column. The amount shown will be displayed in the Amount to Use column. To apply a partial credit amount, simply change the amount of credit applied by changing the amount shown in the Amount to Use column. After entering the amount of credit to apply, click the Done button to apply the credit amount to the selected invoice and return to the Receive Payments window. The credit amount applied will appear in the Credits column at the bottom of this window. You can then finish receiving customer payment as needed within the Receive Payments window. When finished, you can click either the Save and Close or Save and New buttons to save the transaction and either close the window or clear the window, leaving it open for additional entries. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.